Our other top story here at five, an innocent bystander shot and killed trying to stop a hit and run driver. It happened during a chain reaction crash on West Outer Drive in Greenfield on Detroit's west side. Megan Woods joins us live to walk us through what happened. Megan. Yeah, Kimberly, Devin, the details surrounding this situation and what happened are starting to unfold hour by hour. We know that this started as a three car accident. Now we're learning more about the man who was shot and killed. We're also learning about the family that's caught in the middle of all of this. Not only could one person have been dead, you could have been easily been burying four people. Denise Wallace says her daughter-in-law was driving home with Denise's eight and seven-year-old granddaughters in the backseat of this white Dodge SUV. She said the light turned green. She looked at the light. She looked both ways. She went to proceed to take off. And she said all that she knew is wham. And she said the car rolled three times. She said after the first roll, she thought she was dead. She started praying. Then they heard gunshots. Denise says the mother is still in the hospital and the eight-year-old has a broken collarbone and pelvis bone. She's having to visit her in the hospital. And I'm coming down here because my granddaughter, she's serious. She's, she's very injured. She's, it's, it's nothing to play with. They riding around here with these guns, they shooting and they, I mean, it's just crazy. After a further investigation, Detroit police say a Dodge Challenger struck a vehicle that struck another vehicle. That includes Denise's family's car. People in the Challenger tried to run and leave the scene, but a witness tried to convince them to stay. People from that Challenger shot at that witness and killed him. The man had a CPL, and before he died, he was able to shoot at the group of people. The person shot is in the hospital, but under arrest. At this point, Denise is grateful her family is alive, but is frustrated that they're even having to go through this. Because there were three injured people in that white vehicle that no one ever took the time to even mention about. I mean, it's like, who cares? Well, we care. Denise says again that they're extremely grateful. Her grandson, um, his birthday is today. And so she says that that mother is so grateful to be alive, to be able to share that day with the rest of her family. Back to you. Just an awful set of circumstances indeed. Megan, we appreciate it.